hello, hello. Sound is on. Um, let's see. We had um, a group from Vermont uh, come yesterday and today of middle schoolers and their chaperones. Um, they helped Carlene a lot with cleaning out the basement um, and organizing things. Uh, and They've actually moved it all out into the yard, so now we really do look like a trash heap. But okay. anyway, that should be better in a day. <laughs> Yeah, so they, they did help, um, and they did a lot of poop picking for me, um, and one of the chaperones came up to me and was like, are there any, like, dogs you want groomed or anything? And I was like, sure. Uh, Shane and I keep a list of when the last baths were, so we don't, like, bathe them needlessly. Um... So Bella and I did Chaos and Bentley, and then uh, the kids helped with Rora and Cosmo. And both of them were not that big of fans <laughs> for getting bads. Um, but they eventually like realized and stood there. Um, so hopefully next time they get bads, they'll be better. But Dane's coats don't get too dirty that fast, and any like mud pretty much dries and then falls off. Yeah, that that waterless shampoo is wonderful too. Yeah, we use that a lot when we have to do anal glands. Yeah. <laughs> but you can wet you can wet a washcloth down and wipe off a whole dog, and it's not bad. It does work. Um, Sizzle and Gabby's pups uh, started gruel feeding. I've only seen pictures of that so far, but I've seen it with other litters, and it's just so cute to watch. I haven't even seen the picture. Yeah. Uh, Donna told me this morning that yesterday, a lot of the pups like were really confused and didn't know what they were supposed to do with the gruel. Um, she said one gruel feeding a day, is that what you're doing? Yeah. How did yeah. today's go? It went well. They, the uh, Sizzle's pups were a little more lethargic at the, I think they were full. <laughs> but everybody is having opportunity to yeah. eat it. I mean, they're all, they're all getting the concept. It's just the amounts are different. Yeah, I heard yesterday they were really confused. So I was wondering if today they were better. Well, that was their first time. So there's always a lot of confusion. Well, you don't give them too much. Too much is bad. Right. No, yeah, then no. Then you begin to get it back again. <laughs> yeah, no, Diarrhea and everything. Yeah, we're going really light. I mean, it's very thin and it's... Yeah, well, you know, they also... Some of them fall in. <laughs> yeah, face first. Um, that That's scary for them. Yes, Chaos had already had a bath this year, but she can get very stinky. So Linda was uh, asking a little while ago if we could bathe her. So, she's, Chaos is really good with baths. She just stands there and looks miserable. But, um, Bentley was less happy with his bath. Um, he is definitely Carlene's dog. He was like, but my mom's over there. He was like, you don't understand. I need to be with her. He could see her the whole time. He's terrible. <laughs> definitely a Dane. <laughs> Um, I also gave Neville a bath too, so he smells all nice and good. Um, soon I would like to give Gabby and Sizzle baths because they are also stinky. <laughs> there is one very brown dog. Male. Male? Oreo? I mean, it's just hair that just rotten hair that hasn't come out. Yeah, Oreo, Ripple, and Gelato are all like really brown. Mm. Ugh. Yeah, people are always like, "Oh, that's such an interesting color," and I'm like, no, "They're supposed to be black." Yeah. I tell you what you do. Somebody says that you give them those gloves that we have that have a little dubbiness to them, and they just have them sit around and pat them. That would be wonderful. Get that hair out. 
Mm -hmm. There's no shortcut that I know of. What on earth? There's Aldizzi water, the Purina. That'll be one thing for Linda to talk about. <laughs> we got into a great debate about, about how much Purina was going to send us. There's it, two it, more boxes down there that I haven't brought up yet. Did you call me? Remember, remember us arguing about what we were going to get for, for weight washing? Well, 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 we don't argue. We don't argue. I'm sorry about that. It's a discussion. We discussed very loudly. Yeah. <laughs> what were we discussing loudly? Chaos is food. About how much Purina we were going to actually get of this diet stuff. I mean, the, the stuff we get is wonderful. We use it. So we have two dogs that are on a diet. One of them, our friend here. And uh, so we tried to go to the store, the Purina store, to buy it. And I, in my usual fashion, got all screwed up in the store. So I have no idea what, I, so far I've got three cards here, she said there's two more. So I ordered, and I ordered two bags and one case of cans. I've ordered that, that was on auto. And then you ordered two bags and, no, one bag and two cases of cans to go on auto. So in the future, we'll get two bags. What, 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 what are we gonna get now? We're gonna get Three bags of food, three cans, of, three cases of cans. Well, I got the three cases of cans, I think. And she says there's two more boxes down there or something. Okay, then we're good. Why are you looking like that? You said three bags. I don't think I, I don't think we gotta get three bags. I think we gotta get two bags. Yeah. We'll see. We'll They're very heavy. Them. It'll take her a while to get them off the hill. <laughs> We'll use it. We will. Okay. Um, my shirt says, uh, beware of Great Danes, they will steal your heart. Oh, someone asked. Um, are the horses going to be moved soon? They seem to be giving the donkeys a hard time. I'm sick of listening about that. Yeah. <laughs> They'll solve their own problems, guys. I haven't noticed any, like, issues that are concerning. They may, have a, they may have a scrape here or there, and the next thing you know, they're eating out of the same bed. You know? Yeah. They're like kids. And the donkeys are smart enough to stay well out of the way. You know? Yep. It would be very unusual for a donkey to get seriously good. They have a whole conversation that goes on about it. They twitch their head, they flick a tail. Stomp their feet. Kick a, you know, put a foot out. Yep. It's a whole conversation that we don't understand. Yeah. Really. All right. Oh, look at that. Yeah, so no, there's one time. more of those down below that I, I, I'll wait to bring up, but I wanted to make sure. It's the weight management. So there are those two, and then there's two boxes here from Purina. Oh, two of them, Purina. These two here. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, so there are three. Oh, yeah. that's a, looks like a double box. Two bags and then these two. Yeah. So. It looks like Linda was right. Oh, well. That's very annoying. <laughs> Sometimes things happen. It's going to be so weird. Yeah. I'm probably going right. to wake up at 6 and be like, okay, it's like this. Oh. Never mind. Alright, so you're off tomorrow, right? Yes. Switching with Shana? Yes. Awesome. Thank you. Somebody else is on? No, they're switching. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Shame. I'm on Sunday. She's yeah. on tomorrow. Yep. Yep, yep, Okay. So that goes over there. I don't care about that. Our neighbor at, somebody with my name is spelled wrong, and somebody wants to sell shirts. So I got rid of that problem. That happens a lot. They spell your name wrong. Oh. The only thing I'll mind is... I'm right here. Water. What are you looking for? Oh, the water. I didn't come out of there with water. I had it. Oh. Hmm. I don't know who takes it. Thank you. Fun. Yep. 
Okay. I didn't do anything about that one yet. All right, I'll just sit here by myself. All by myself and figure this out. Oh. And here we have from Lisa Perry Cohn. Well, that's wonderful. Thank you very much. Doesn't say, and isn't that wonderful? Thank you. That's just for general usage. That's cone. Cone. Yeah. And then we have Jennifer Peralt, Long Beach, California. Oh, it says Linda Private on the next one. This is Jennifer Pro. There, you can have that one. DFT for garbage guy. Huh? Well, let's see what this is all about. It was. Ho I was hoping to mail it, make it to Dog Fest, but life happens, so I'll try for next year. Since you will be generating a lot of additional trash with the big party, I thought I could buy two Dogfest t-shirts for your garbage guy. A little thank you to the, for the driver for a very important truck with a very important job. I mean, I love all our police and staff, but who can't get, who can't get to love the garbage guy? Wonderful, now I really approve of that. That's a good one, Linda. Yeah. A couple things here. We have one labeled personal for you, private. And we also have a check for a dog fest shirt for the garbage guy. That's a good thing. The garbage guy? Yes. It's a gift. Mello? Jennifer? Yeah. Yeah? Oh. Isn't that wonderful? That's really nice. I mean, That's thoughtful. It is. She says that we're going to be generating a lot of additional trash with a big party, ba ba ba. I have to put on my two t-shirts for your garbage guy. Who is that? Who did that? Jennifer. Peralt's Keller. Oh, Jennifer, that's really thought. I think that's one of the best things that's happened all day. Yeah. Isn't that wonderful? So I'm putting this in here. All right, and save the card. And save the card. Yeah. I'll save the card. Put the card in there, too. Okay, we did here. This is personal. Give that to her through the gate. Got it? Yes. And this is Guillaume Miller, Henderson, Nevada. Guillaume Miller. Thank you. Thanks, Bella. Have, have a good one. I would like to buy five chicken bricks in memory of my husband, Harold, Hal Meyer. He was a huge fan and especially enjoyed watching the puppies. Well, isn't that wonderful? Thank you very much, Guillaume Miller. You get five chicken bricks off right ahead for you, right there. Oh. Okay. And this is Melissa Fryer, Ackworth, Georgia. Two chicken bricks, please. I've been a CP since 2012. Isn't that wonderful? That's Melissa Fryer. We can do that. That goes in here. And then the two bricks goes in here. <coughs> and this is Dia Rotten. I can't get over to a shirt for the garbage guy. That's got to be something else again. There we go. And this is, this is for 20 chicken bricks. Whoa, I own a rotten. 
I own a pen around D. Okay. Who did I hear? Oh. That movie I was talking about with that guy, Frank. Catch me if you can. Catch me if you can. He went to Iona College. Ah. Iona College is right across from that McDonald's down there in New Rochelle. Mm-hmm. Huh. Okay. And this is from Harold Wanda. Here we go. Whole grains and vitamins and lemon. And there's a pecan in that thing. Okay. And we have Suzanne from Freeville, New York. Oh, geez, Linda, you got another personal confidential. Jesus. You better look in this envelope very carefully. There's stuff falling all over the place here. And clothes, please, fine. Chicken brick and a dollar for the fun fun. Thank you. Ha-ha, Suzanne. Okay, that can go in here. And then this can go in here. And these can be up here. And this is personal and confidential. Again. Okay. Refrigerator repairman. Distributed by Amazon Services, Seattle, Washington. Made in the USA with domestic and imported materials. Landshark. Huh. Okay. It's a very impressive looking box. Before you, the personal envelopes that I am getting are all dog fest payments. I just want everybody to know. That's what she said, Billy. Oh, who knows? <laughs> who knows? Ah. Okay. Get there, by golly. Why is that doesn't want to open? I'm going to make it get open. Huh. There we go. There. Got it. Wow. Okay. Unscented. Baby wipes. Beautiful. Okay. Is there a name on that one? I didn't find it yet. Okay. Oh, there we go. Fogan. That's from Fogan. Fogan. Thank you, Fogan. Thank you, Fogan. We can use the baby wipes. This is good for a bit now. Yep. Where we really have, and then um, Sam ordered baby food, which will be here shortly. Oh, really? And we have lots of goat's milk. We have lots of fluffy. I mean, we're really in good shape. We're in good shape, I think. Yeah. For the shape we're in. Yeah. We can just find everything. We'll be all set. Yeah. This is Amazon Fulfillment. Espresso roast. Oh my. Oh. 
think now. Holy cow. That's one of those. Variety pack. And check. And we didn't get any. Brew, froth, and enjoy. And we didn't get any piece of paper with it. Try this it's on a very nice box, walking. though. Huh. Doesn't say who. Oh, no. Really? That's... It doesn't say who. Oh, bummer. What's that over there? Uh, those are, I was, I'm not sure what, I, get the I was thinking Get the small one, put the, get the small one. This is so everybody knows we have it. They don't have to go and get it for us. And here we have a bubble wrap. I'm going to need that bubble wrap. I have something I need to ship. Okay. If you can have that. Okay. And put that under the sofa. Yep. Got it. Where are somebody going to send it? So we have two weight management things. We got them. Yep. And one case of this. So, well, you want to see what this one is? I, I know what it is. Let's see if you can. Five two seven four customer. Okay. One wonders what we will get next month. I guess we'll have to ask Linda. Okay. Well, I can go in here, and then this I'll save this box for shipping my mystery piece of something I gotta ship. Okay. In your room? Sure. And I'll be able to find it. Ah. Mm. Highlights. What? I guess we're on highlights. Now we're back. We must have been on highlights for a minute. Okay. A few seconds. How thoughtful to think of the trash hauler and all the extra that work. That is wonderful. I heard him laugh and shout as he was driving away with a very full 
ripe load on the Monday after Dog Fest. <laughs> you sh guys sure know how to party. That's Betsy from Nevada. Yep. How old is Bentley now? I don't know. We have apparently, apparently he's nine. Someone answered he's eight in June. It was eight he's in gotta June. Gotta be more eight. Let's go to our handy dandy. Right hand. there. Here it is. Right here. All right. Right there, right there. He's born at 11. Yeah, eight. He just turned eight or turned nine? He just One. turned eight, because it's nine. Wow. Yeah. I've been telling everybody he was 10. I know. Chaos is 10. Chaos is 10. Or something like that. Chaos is like older than him, I think. Chaos is over here. Chaos, okay, so That's she was right born there. in nine, so she's 10. She turned 10 in April of this year. So she's like 10 and, and, and he was born June of 2011. June of 11, okay, whatever. Okay. They had baths today, Chaos and Bentley. Um, haven't seen Deb in a while, is she on vacation? I don't know. No, she's around. She is here. I've seen her come and go. I don't know. Yeah, what she's was. off today, but she's here. Um, highlights. That's weird. FYI, they went to a highlights on five seventeen. Okay. All right. Now there are less shavings in the barn. We see the bats, uh, mats. Any other material to use? The trouble with it is you let it get dirty. That's what you guys don't understand. It's this light, you let it get peed on. I thought you stand and water it down with a hose, you know, to cut the dust. That's why I think that dog horse is coughing. Oh, from, from shaving too many shavings. Dust. The shavings also, I mean, sometimes there's clean shavings and sometimes it's a little dusty. We've had some dusty shavings lately. Um, you know, you don't just throw it in there and think everything is wonderful. Yeah. You leave it there for a bit and let it, it should be a sort of dark tan color, not the blonde shavings that it is. The manure pile is entirely the wrong color. Hmm. You know, you get a little urine mixed with it, that wets it down and it doesn't blow up their nose. Eating out of the hay bags is helpful, but you know, when hay drops onto the ground, if they pick it up, they're getting a nose full of shavings too. Mm -hmm. And everybody thinks it's wonderful to have it so spotlessly clean, but that's not true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know how to, I don't know how to get it across. I can't. Nobody listens. I just. Well, I why? Know. What is nobody listening to? Like as In I fact, do. I said, don't. You know, just pick out the shit. Ah, uh, okay. Just pick out. That's what those pitchforks are for. That are so close, close together that you can slide under and shake it a little bit, and you have all the puckies. Yeah. And the rest is kind of blends in. Okay. Is there a memorial area for the dogs who have passed? Yes. Bentley's mom, Olive, is 10, two weeks older than Chaos. Okay. As usual, I've been away from here for a while. I see Chaos is on the futon. Has she tried to see the puppies yet? Uh, yes, every 20 minutes. <laughs> Last week she was positioned, there was a sliver of light coming through from the puppy pen on, and she sat and stared at that sliver for hours. Nothing happened, she just stared at the sliver. Anybody else? I've been peed on before by Perry Cole. A little pee never hurt any, anything. <laughs> that is true. Uh -huh. Don and I can attest to that on a daily basis in the puppy pen. We sit down and it happens. Water appears. Water appears. It's sterile. A healthy animal puts out sterile. There urine. are some countries that they drink their urine and they use it as a form of fasting and cleaning out their cleansing their body so yeah. I know I'm but I but I know that that is that some 
cultures do that. Anybody Hopefully else? Not around here. No, it's but it's but but it's but I oh, read yeah. stories of them oh, yeah. doing that, and that is a that was a cleansing scenario, and they live to tell. So I don't know. Nothing is shocking to me anymore. Um, there's a whole cemetery. Yeah, there are, there's the cemetery on pop at the at the flat field. There are a variety of spots, but around the pond. Uh, Bailey is around the pond, and there's another spot. Tiffany. That, Tiffany and Bailey are around. And Ellie. And Ellie. Because I know that over to the right of Bailey, there are some flowers. I kind of want to do that. I mean, they're just daisies, but they came up on the ground, and it's dry, and they look pretty over there. That's why I clean my house too often. I don't want anyone to get sick. <laughs> Don't they think that that's the problem with some of our immune system is, is that everybody too uses clean. too much hand sanitizer yeah. and we're too clean? And My kids used to go out to the... I, I fertilized the garden with horseshit. And I'd send them out to eat both peas and carrots. The carrots you wipe off in your armpit and you eat them. Yeah. Yeah. They're fine. Healthy kids. What's for dinner? There is, we're having uh, pot roast. There was a pot roast from Costco and potatoes. Okay. Is that it? Are we done? I think so. I think so. We're all setting graces on tonight with um, a riot. So we will... Talk to you later. And there's only one on tonight, correct? Yes. yes. Yep. Okay, thank you so much.